All right, Lawrence, what have you got? All right, we have eight bizarre animals. Let's start with the Mexican mole lizard. The Mexican mole lizard is not Ooh. a mole and it's not a lizard. No. But it does live in Mexico. And as they live underground, it is rarely seen, which is a shame because when wow. you look at this thing, yeah, look adorable, at adorable, right? Look how cuddly wow. it is. Yeah. How'd they get that picture? Did yeah. Stake him, stake him out, or yeah, sit there for a long time. Oh, it's a unique So if it's not a mole and it's now a lizard, what is it? It's a reptile of oh. some <clears throat> off separate species. It's adorable, is what yeah. it is. All right, the next one is like a hedgehog. All right. Combined with a porcupine oh. and an armadillo. What? It's the Lowland Streak Tenric huh. from Madagascar. <laughs> wow. And when this guy is threatened, it rolls into a ball and the spines protect it, kind of like what an armadillo does. It remains the and, and a porcupine. The only animal to generate sound by rubbing body parts together. Oh. Like a huh. cricket. Boy, it'd be great to see video or yeah. something yeah, of no. this thing in action. Nope. They're, they're very hard they, to find. Hard, and they yeah. don't perform on command. Yeah, and this one is even harder to find. The Trogloraptor. It looks very dangerous, but spider scientists say they are no threat to you. Wow. What's different about this spider is it evolved claws on the end of each of its eight long, thin legs. Wow -wee. Where is it found? Another surprise. Naperville. It, it, well, <laughs> you're not far off. It was only discovered in 2010 by three people exploring a cave in southwest Oregon. It's the only ah. place where they're known to exist. Interesting. Oregon's not really close to Naperville. Uh, well, but it's it is it's west. It's, yeah. yeah. That's right. right. I just, I thought that yeah. would be like. Yeah, anything west of 355 <laughs> might as well be right. like Oregon. I thought it'd be Africa or, right, you yeah. know, some, yeah. Yeah, that's you know, fair, yeah. just kind of more uh, Not United exotic States. place. Geography's yeah. never been your yeah. strength anyway. Uh, next is the frilled lizard. What? Oh. This, this reminds me of that, uh, what was the dinosaur movie? Uh, uh, with, Jurassic uh, Park? Yeah, Jurassic Park. These, these things kind of popped up, in, except they were huge. Oh, yeah. They yeah. Were yeah. Is he standing version. on his back legs? Well, well yes. The Here's the thing. And Stranger Things? That right? too. Yeah. He lives in Australia and New Guinea. The fold around the neck flares out to intimidate predators, and they can uh -huh. run so fast that sometimes they end up running on their hind legs. Oh, like the old frilled lizard. Is that its mouth? That triangle thing? Yes. Yeah, so. he's saying, hello. Yeah. He's singing there. Yeah. It's like he's saying, waka waka. Uh, yeah. I gotta be me. <laughs> he's the Dan Ponce of lizards. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Uh, All right, this sounds very exotic and maybe even dangerous. The Commodore. What? Is that Look how you at say that. It? Yeah, sure. It's oh. known as the Hungarian Sheepdog. Yeah. They are livestock guardian dogs. Their coats are corded like a car wash mop. Wow. They're good with family and other family pets, but Hungarian Commodore breeders yeah. say an intruder may be allowed to enter the property but he will not be allowed to leave wow. or escape. Oh, well, well, they're vicious, get one of those. Huh? Well, they're kind of laid back, unless right. it's a stranger coming in. And so they kind of they're like, come on in. Kinda come on in, yeah. And they kind of lure you in with their cuteness. And then, and then they eat you like They your lock face. the door. And like, it's over. It's over. Wow. Wow. Yeah. wow. We may have talked about this one before, the Dumbo octopus. They live at depths of 4,000 feet, so you don't see them too much, but they kind of look like Dumbo. Oh, yeah, boy. They and uh, they are sometimes eaten by sharks and are other large fish. looking at the face or the back side here? Is he no, swimming away I, from I us or to us? No, I think that's the front side, unfortunately. Ah. They move by flapping their fins, which look like elephant ears. So it kind of ah. looks like an elephant. Mm. All right, here's the uh, another what if. What if you combined a manatee and a dolphin? All right. You get a dugong. Ooh, wow. that's fun. Is that what say. happened? Yeah. They are related to manatees and they look like them, but they have a dolphin tail. So some believe they are what were mistaken for mermaids. Yeah, I can see the uh -huh. The mermaids yeah. are their own separate thing. Yeah. Huh, so the manatees and the dolphins got together and came up with the new little thing I think that's what there. happened. Wow. I don't know for sure. Yeah. But very scandalous and the mermaids were probably happened. sitting around watching going, yeah. this yeah. is wrong. It's yeah. suspicious. Yeah. Uh, last one is the red-lipped batfish. Ooh. They don't swim well, but they look good. Yeah, they, they crawl do. around the ocean floor of the Pacific near Peru. Very specific place. Red-fished. Oh. Red-lipped batfish. Red-lipped mm. batfish. Mm. Something for the kids. Yeah. You're going to school tomorrow. You're uh. not going to be around for the nine and nine. Yeah, yeah. Right. Get conversation, you yeah. Warmed up for school. Yeah, that's good You're stuff, welcome, Larry. Kids. 
There we go.